Hello everyone, welcome to Crypto Hallmark. In this video, we'll talk about upcoming potential airdrop project ZK Sync. And probably I feel a snapshot a still had not been taken. And all details will be covered in this video, like testnet and mainnet version, because they just launched their BB Alpha version on 28th of October, and before that, only testnet was live. And they are planning for their mainnet alpha version, like full launch alpha version, on early 2023 or probably on December end of 2022. So, like they are planning a lots of things and there are only few of the projects is currently live in minute version so i feel there is no a step thought has been taken and you can try out a lots of project basically and currently they are live on testnet and also live on minute so basically i i recommend you guys try testnet and also do try minute in this video we'll cover testnet testnet thing and also minute things you can see from here like jk sank ha have really good backers you can see like ethereum foundation 1kx protocol huawei ventures binance coinbase okx so basically if they will launch in future any token it will get listed on most of the uh, big central exchanges that's a really great thing so you must try all the things and get eligible for their uh, airdrop so let's get start started like what is jk sank JK Sync is a layer 2 scaling solution on Ethereum blockchain that offers low gas fee and fast transaction. Basically, there are already in uh, in the market, there are already uh, few of the layer 2 solution is live. And you can see like Arbitrum 1, one have maximum total value lock 2.73 billion dollar. And like it have there is there is no token as of now. And but they are planning for the RV token launch in the upcoming up, up, upcoming month. So it's also a potential project which can do airdrop to their early user if you will say we will create a separate video for the arbitrum one optimism and dydx dydx was the first project which given a very big airdrop to the, their early users and optimism also given uh, a airdrop rewards to their uh, early users loopring have own tokens metis have own token jk sync is on seven, seven number with 64 million dollar total value logged in their platform so basically there is no token size of now so it's a really potential project which can give airdrop so let's get started like what are the things we can do on mainnet first and then we will see on testnet too so first of all you need to uh, go to uh, this wallet like wallet.jetcasing.io from that you need to uh, top up your wallet and you can as a gas fee you need to pay some of some of the amount in this video like we will uh, deposit 0.1 ethereum like for for the top up you can use a lots of other platform but i recommend you jk sync and click on jk sync and simply deposit i'm depositing 0.11 ethereum as a gas fee you need to pay some some of the amount that will be one time pay gas fee you don't need to pay every time like yeah, in the gas fee uh, i'm paying 1.5 dollar in few seconds it will be done and after that you can see your balance will be transferred to the layer 2 basically before that it was like 0.116 balance like like now 0.11 balance has been transferred to their l2 balance click on ok you can see your balance from here uh, it will take some of the time okay so after completing deposit in uh, layer 2 balance it will take few minutes to show here like you can see i'm i'm you can see here 0.11 ethereum in layer 2 solution so basically we did top up now we need to do some swaps basically currently only zigzag exchange is live on uh, mainnet version click on that when you will click on it simply you can transfer uh, like you need to connect wallet simply connect it after connecting wallet you need to sign you can see from here like ethereum and usdc you can transfer uh, so, some of the like ethereum to usdc and you can do regular swaps from here so basically 0 0.1 ethereum you can see here so let's i am transferring 0 0.01 ethereum to usdc just you need to click on sell ethereum and you no need to pay gas fees because you already paid 1.5 dollar as a gas fee in the start and like now you don't need to pay any gas fees. you can see here now 16.53 dollar has been converted uh, from ethereum so basically we did swap you need to do regular swaps so get uh, you can be eligible for, for higher amount of airdrops or, or many more things and apart from it like you need to do some transfer like we did 
currently layer 1 to layer 2 and do some uh, uh, transfer from zk sync to ethereum like l2 solution to l1 swaps so basically do also that i am not doing escaping here but you you can you can do that now click on nft that's also live in mainnet basically you can mint nfts from here so basically for it you go to uh, you need to go to pinata.cloud basically every link has been added in the description don't worry about that just now click on upload you can upload any file or folder click on upload avatar 11 like you need to copy the cid copy cid and click on uh, mint nft when you will click on mint nft you you need to paste here 0x has or like cid i, I we are uh, uh, clicking cid or authorize to mint nft you no need to pay any any gas fee that's a quite good thing just click on mint nft it will take few of minutes and it, your nft will be minted after few seconds of uh, approving transaction your nft will be minted here click on okay you can see your nft here okay so basically you minted some of the nft here and also you did top up transfer swaps so basically this task uh, was in the mainnet version so i would recommend you guys keep doing some of the transaction regularly uh, swaps transfer top up and then also you can do some multiple nft mint here okay and like gas fee is quite quite less in the layer 2 solution you just need to pay one time gas fee as a 2 2 dollar or 3 dollar as per the uh, gas fee uh, uh, okay so we used this platform on mainnet now we need to use zk sync in the testnet version so for the testnet version we need to click on, go to chainlist.org click on it you need to toggle here from testnet click on it and now we need to search here zk sync now you can see zk sync alpha testnet connect wallet here after connecting wallet click on add to metamask you can see from here like uh jetk sync alpha testnet version has been added here right now for the gas like we have already used for the platform earlier so we have some of the gas fee but when you will start here you will be there will be no gas fee so you need to cancel the gas fee from sending the project so basically click on metamask you need to go to that website click on that you can see some of the balances here okay click go to faucet click here request funds from faucet you need to do some to, uh, tweet click on that you need to wait for you few minutes after few minutes you can see here like 749 dollar like we have got dai link usdc and some of the wbtc wrapped btc so basically what we need to do we need to do some task on testnet 2 so there is first protocol uh, ot protocol earlier their na name was 1kx protocol it's basically based on zk sync and aptos we need to use here zk sync click on zk sync connect wallet you can also you get here testnet tokens same as zk sync click on that okay so you can click on that basically but you can also skip because you have already some of the fees here but we will also tell you like how you can get regular gas fee and other things in other platform click on trade you can here trade some task click on like i can see her still here there is lag in websites you can try multiple times might be there will be lagging because it's currently live in the testnet version only website is lagging after couple of minutes you can see here like there is currently 100 uh, link so you can do some swaps website is little bit lagging but you can try multiple times now we are uh, swapping some of the usdc and dai let's click on swap approve transaction it's it's swap done say in the same way you can also make pool click on pools let's make it new pool here click on link or any other amount okay so i click on 10 uh, i am adding here link click on add liquidity liquidity bill be added okay so you need to uh, approve the transaction fee here in the testnet version so basically you have added here some of the link here so you can also borrow from here like you can see here lp liquidity is 0.038 something you can borrow something here from uh, from here 
so you do borrow and like swap and uh, also you can do uh, add liquidity trade and uh, borrow something okay so now i am coming to mint a square basically it's a nft marketplace on jk sync alpha testnet version so basically you can mint nft here and also you can buy some of the nft here so click on mint upload your uh, images okay click on uh, add de details and click on mint and in in profile you can see your minted nft you can do some of the mint nft and also use this platform basically if you will use ot protocol or mint square or any other platform basically you are also might be eligible for this platform if they will launch their native token they can also reward you in that case so i recommend use this platform regularly now we will use here a space basically it's also like it's a swap pool and same platform as a ot protocol so also use this platform basically don't miss it miss to use this platform basically they can also airdrop as an early user okay so click on connect to wallet do some swaps like you can see here click on swap approve transaction after doing swap you can also add pool add liquidity what you want to add in the liquidity click on that like i am adding here dai and link basically okay so let let's add 10 link click on supply confirm supply do some of the transaction regularly swap pool etc and now i am coming to another platform it's another dex mute.io uh, on jk sync alpha testnet so basically same here you need to do some swaps pool okay so i i believe you can do it easily it's the same as a space and after that like there is another platform tevera it's a gaming platform basically it's a uh, live in in the uh, testnet and also it's live on the mainnet basically so you can try and uh, check out like what are the possibilities you can play their game and also might you will be eligible for their uh, tokens here drop so uh, let's try that there is no information but if you will tell me we will create a separate video for tevera so now it's now come to the jk sino it's the same platform from Jigjag exchange basically we use Jigjag exchange and this this is the platform from uh, Jigjag exchange only so basically in this video in this uh, we can play some games or casino on jk sync alpha testnet so simply click connect wallet we have already connected that wallet click on request and tweet and after that mint jk usd and start playing if you need a, need a separate video for the jk casino we will do that so in this video that's it guys make sure to use every platform like uh, jk sync testnet and mainnet uh, regularly so might you will be eligible for the big airdrop that's it bye bye have a good day if you like this video then don't miss to hit like button and subscribe this channel